I was brought up on a farm in the northeast of Scotland, so about 25 miles northwest of Aberdeen itself. When I return to Aberdeen, it can be for all sorts of reasons. So sometimes I perform here, perhaps at the music hall. I have my duties as chancellor at Robert Gordon University, which I absolutely love. You always feel inspired as soon as you enter this campus. We're surrounded by great natural landscapes, but also innovative buildings. Well, Aberdeen certainly has changed, and a city will always change. However, now it's really opening up to being a global city. When you come to Aberdeenshire, you feel the softness, you feel, in a way, the phrases, beautiful long phrases, and they just sort of very smoothly tail off. When you take the time to slow all of the senses down and truly connect with what is here, it's an incredible kind of medicine to have. It's just so important for our physical and well-being. And a lot of the pieces that I wrote when I was a child were very much inspired by the movement of the wheat or the barley, the wind, of course, the density of the woods. It's just connecting those childhood memories to where you're at today and you never forget where you were brought up.